with regard to the uh, clarification that uh, you sought uh, insofar as uh, what patrolling will entail uh, under the agreement uh, that was reached uh, yesterday. Uh, well, what it will entail is that in the pending areas under discussion, uh, patrolling and indeed uh, grazing activities, wherever applicable, uh, will revert to the situation as it obtained in 2020. Uh, incidentally, uh, I should say that this is also what the External Affairs Minister was talking about yesterday uh, when he was speaking at the uh, NDTV uh, World Summit, uh, I think. Uh, and uh, as to the uh, uh, other part of your question, uh, you know, what the uh, as far as the disengagement agreements uh, reached previously are concerned, those agreements were not uh, reopened in these discussions. Uh, the agreement that was reached uh, yesterday, very early yesterday morning, uh, was focused on issues that had remained outstanding uh, in the last uh, couple of uh, years. So uh, that is uh, what uh, I would say at this uh, point in time. Vishal, ye aapke sawal ka, aapke prashn ka bhi uttar isme hai. Jaisa maine kaha ki jo aapne sawal poochha tha ki patrolling ki jo patrolling pe jo samjhota kal hua hai, uska, uske maane kya hai? To uske maane ye hai ki jo kuch sawal reh gaye the, jinke baare mein pichle do saal se baat chhi chal rahi thi, तो वहां पे पेट्रोलिंग और ग्रेजिंग जहां पे भी वो लागू हो तो वो वाली जो स्थिति है वो 2020 की स्थिति वहां पे बहाल हो जाएगी और मैं ये भी कह रहा था कि कल जब विदेश मंत्री एनडीटीवी वर्ल्ड समिट के मौके पे बोल रहे थे तो उनका तात्पर्य भी इसी से था और जो uh, मेरे ख्याल से uh, साहिल का प्रश्न था ये भी कि जो पहले एग्रीमेंट्स हुई हैं उस पे क्या असर पड़ेगा uh, कल की एग्रीमेंट का तो जो पहले की एग्रीमेंट्स हैं उसके बारे में इन uh, जो अभी चर्चा समाप्त हुई है उसमें पहले की एग्रीमेंट्स को फिर से हमने खोला नहीं ये चर्चा जो थी ये पेंडिंग एग्रीमेंट्स पे जो आउटस्टैंडिंग इश्यूज थे उनको लेके थी